So here at the Netgear table at Pepcom, uh, night before CES, showing off their Orbi devices. They've got some really innovative stuff here. The Orbi Voice, which has an Amazon Alexa speaker built in. Uh, the audio is by Harman Kardon. That's going to be $430 with a base station router. That actually is, a, is just a satellite node in terms of the networking component of it. And then we also have the uh, Cable Orbi. The Cable Orbi is going to be $400 with a single node. This actually functions as your, this is actually a router and cable modem. Let's turn it around. So this is a great replacement for all you Xfinity and, and uh, other cable uh, modem users. You pick this up and not only is it your cable modem, but it's also a network node for a mesh system. So it, start, it allows you to start building out your node. You can buy that for $300 on its own or $400 with a single node. And of course you can add unlimited number of nodes uh, to an Orbi system. And the one great thing about Orbi that really distinguishes it from all the competitors out there is that every Orbi product has dedicated backhaul. And they've done that by uh, centralizing their router. Each system has a dedicated router and then dedicated nodes. And those dedicated nodes have different radios inside. And so they can really optimize each one. Uh, the competitors out there, Netgear's competitors out there, are using nodes that are all identical. And they can all function as a router or a node, but that means they're not really optimized for one or the other. So Netgear has really decided that to get the best performance, they just have to optimize the router component and then the, the node components. And that's why they always achieve the best performance in head-to-head -head tests.